a music theory community. Today we're going to discuss species counterpoint four, and here I have good student work in the form. Um, we are in the key of C major, and in species counterpoint uh, four, you compose in half notes against a given whole note cantus. Um, what's important about the half notes is that now, for the first time, you're able to put a dissonance on a downbeat. Dissonance meaning a 7, a 4, a 2, or a 9. Okay, so they're, they're put on a downbeat via suspension, so they're tied over the bar line. It's crucial that the note on the second beat, or the second half note, is a consonant interval. So, species counterpoint 4 explores the use of suspension and resolution. So, let's, let's start looking. Here on that second half note, can species counterpoint 4 allows us to start with a half rest. The student starts with an octave, C, you can get an alto clef, C to C. And now the alto, the uh, cantus shifts up to a D. The uh, composed line, or the cantus sustains, generates a seventh, and the seventh resolves itself down to a six. Try to typically resolve um, your your suspension or your dissonance downward, which is the, the natural uh, way to resolve. Um, so you're going to want to create these chains of suspensions. And again, the, the upbeat, or the second beat in the measure, has to be a consonant interval. Also, there can be no unprepared there no unprepared dissonances. So no uh, two fours sevens or nines without uh, being tied over via suspension. Uh, this piece is in the key of C, and what I'm noticing here is that the student is prepping a rise to some sort of a subdominant area here, and then reaching a climax. So that's quite interesting. The fact that through the use of suspension, there's that continual, continuous need to, to descend, but the student eventually breaks with the suspension and rises to the dominant, to five, and then cadences. So let's take a look at um, some good techniques the student uh, used. So I find it quite interesting the fact that there's a suspension chain falling here, uh, six, seven, six, seven, six, and then finally he can skip up. The only time that you can skip is preferably within the measure and involving two consonant intervals. So here is that occasion. Here's another occasion, 10, six, within the measure there's a skip. So you will have to provide some interesting skips in order to break from the use of the falling suspension. One more time, opening. Very nice, overall, very interesting uh, species counterpoint for exercise in the form. Thank you.